Hi friends, welcome to testing tutorials point. This is Lokesh and today we are going to discussing about a difference between implicit weight and explicit weight and fluent weight. What exactly these three things difference? First implicit weight. An implicit weight, it will wait until complete a page a load okay it will wait until complete page load explicitly wait it will wait until element web element load given time okay if you provide a 10 seconds it will wait for 10 seconds and also it will check for that particular web element is not present or not now fluent wait it will wait until the same for certain time given time and also it will check it will check web element frequently frequently it will check the web element is visible or not okay and if it is that explicitly wait if it is already waited at 10 seconds for the particular web element why required for fluent wait means there is a chances web element is a visible immediately loaded means the page is loaded but it is not immediately loaded but whenever it's loaded after one second or two seconds of the time whenever you were before web driver after calling the web driver maybe it is not able to locate it but after two seconds it is loaded but you declare as a 10 seconds for that particular web element to load the time but you don't want to wait that complete time slam completion then you can able to use this fluent weight and the frequency of one second or two seconds three seconds four seconds you can able to use what will happen if you give the frequency means it will do for pulling means every second it will check that particular web element it is visible or not if it is visible then it will find that web element and it, what kind of operation you do uh, you given to the web driver that particular action it will do and it will goes off what exactly the syntax will be presented means you can able to see there is a driver dot implicit weight this is a simple format of declaring for that particular web element or uh, implicitly weight purpose and explicitly weight we can able to use a weight until this one this is called explicitly weight and also we can able to use this particular certain condition one this explicitly weight syntax web driver weight a driver and time which time how much time it need to be run and also what kind of things we can able to this ec means expected condition what kind of a uh, condition you are going to check like a where element is not visible you can remove a dot you can click you can able to see here there are so many operations are present even you can able to no such element exception also presented even that also can any of element attribute including this even you can able to do for the drop down is selected or not the frame is presented or not invisible of element that particular element invisible it is we can able to check new window is opened or not alerts are present or, or not no such frame exception like uh, we can able to throw it this kind of operations we can able to check for this using uh, expected condition places okay 
the same for fluent weight also it's the same similar format of expected condition but only thing is we are going to use for pool frequency and as well as we are going to use for ignore exceptions ignore exception means what kind of exception you're going to ignore it that you need to give it and that you can able to declare here as a list you can able to n number of things you can able to declare what how many exception you want to exclude that that all the things you can able to use it here our remaining operations are same okay this is all about for difference between these two or uh, three implicit and explicit and fluent weight and another one is a time dot sleep it's a common name used right time dot a sleep it is like a java what happened uh, thread dot sleep is there a similar format it's a time dot sleep is presented it's an inbuilt one okay what will happen if you declare some time if you declare something the time 10 seconds if that web element is uh, visible are not visible it will wait that particular time after that it will do operation if it is visible it is fine if it is not visible it will throw exception okay if you declare 20 or 50 150 like that what will happen it will wait until the time is completion in case if it is visible also already visible the elements but still it will wait 150 means what will happen our time slump it is more it will increase right that will happen the problems that's why this selenium introduced for this particular three concepts fluent implicit and explicitly and fluent weight okay this is all about three things for the differentiations i hope you understand this video if you like this video please like me please subscribe my youtube channel and don't forget to share your friends and colleagues thank you